in Sochi now. Uh, just got in today. I decided to stop by the Olympic Village, which is all of this. It is surprisingly empty. There's no one here. I was so scared when I was coming here because it's one of the most popular towns in Russia. So I thought it would have, uh, like, I thought there would be so many people. I think there may be somewhere else but it's surprisingly spacious and so empty. So I'm gonna check out where the Olympics were held and maybe grab something to eat and then head to actual Sochi. This is some other area, I don't know. Um, to meet up with my family who are also coming. Yeah, this is a great place for a video, as you can tell. I was not kidding about the, the beach being all rock. I don't know if you can hear it well or not, but yeah, it's all rock, so it's like you can't really. I don't know. Not my vibe. Also, there are like building stuff, standing stuff constantly, which is nice. Again, it's my first time, so I don't know how it was before, but so far, I think it's good. Also, I wonder if they're just building this for beach season because it's just like wood pieces. So it makes no sense for it to be forever. And I think then they take it down, which is a cute idea. I've never lived in a beach town. So I don't know if that's like a common practice or if this is just something that they do over here. <laughs> but I feel like that's smart. Yeah, people are working even though it's Sunday. We have this drink in New York, but they sell this oversized version here, and it's it's pretty. And it's all for me, just because I'm traveling by myself. So obviously, I'm not gonna drink this whole thing because it's like two two liters of alcohol in here. Um, but I felt like I had to try it. I mean, it tastes pretty good so far, but we'll see. I just left that restaurant with the huge cup <laughs> I didn't even finish it they chased me out and they were like can we clean this because we need space I was like yeah for sure there's no way I'm gonna finish all of that I mean I could but then I definitely would not be able to walk so I'm walking to the train station and they have this little cute um, amusement park I also realized how much I miss mountains um, in Kaliningrad we don't really have mountains also in New York, I don't believe we have mountains either. Like you can go and see them somewhere else, but we don't typically just have them in the city. So I think like, yeah, I just haven't seen them in so long and it was really nice seeing, just seeing them and it just makes me wanna go explore in there. So hopefully one of the days I can 
actually go do that because I don't have anything really planned um, because the weather is so different and uh, I think like hiking is maybe not advisable when it's raining so we'll see but definitely want to go check out some mountains because they look amazing from afar second day I'm on the promenade walk beach thing lots of restaurants lots of people tanning and just hanging out I guess I'm um, just checking out all the restaurants they have so many cute places I don't know if I'm gonna be eating much here just because it's very heavy on meat and fish and everything like that and since I'm a vegetarian it's not it's not the best to find food but hopefully I find something. I mean, there's always a salad, I guess. Yeah, so super cute. The water is super blue, but like a light blue. But again, like I said yesterday, there's so many rocks. So it's like not ideal, but some people really love it. Tell that you. 